Hi everyone, Mitch from PickDogs.com here with Costi um, talking Jacksonville Jaguars versus Buffalo Bills week five NFL action. This is our early look video series. So later on in the week, we'll be deep diving and as the week goes on. Of course, I give the handicapper high level perspective where I am in my handicapping this week, which is just getting started. And of course, Costi's going to look at it from a sharp trading perspective, looking purely at the numbers, the early line movement, and give us the perspective on the game from there. This is in lieu of our uh, early line report that we were doing and our early video report. Just combo it up and uh, let's make some money. But anyways, let's head to uh, England. We go to uh, the game between the Jaguars and the Bills. The Bills coming off a monster win over the Dolphins. Big time letdown spot, you would think, here against the Jaguars team that was a playoff team a year ago, but we're starting to see Doug Peterson look like the coach that got fired in Philadelphia, making a lot of very questionable calls this this, this season, including that fourth and five against the Chiefs with two minutes left to go in the half as uh, handed the ball. Chris Jones sack. Mahomes gets the ball at the, at the 50 with under two minutes left to go in the path. Half, uh, they pay the Patrick price and go on to lose the game. But the thing is, is that the Jags in London are a different team. This is a team that they've stayed in London now after playing last week in London. And it's a team that always plays in London. So they know the restaurants. They know the hotels. They know the routines. And now they're accustomed to the time zone. They, I would think the Bills are the better team, certainly the hotter team right now, after losing in week one um, to the Jets in that come-from-behind victory. But really, since then, the Bills have been one of the top teams in the NFL and really flying under the radar this year compared to some of those earlier seasons where the expectation was that they were the team to beat to go to the Super Bowl. This year, you didn't even hear a lot of mention that it was, you know, that the Bills were the team to beat in the AFC, but they certainly are very, very loaded. And we saw that, especially on the defensive side of the ball with Oliver and Rousseau and company. But the, Von Miller, I believe, is uh, due back for them as well. Thing is, you know, the Jags still in part of the learning process, but I do think these games in London do give them the advantage. So my early lean here is going to be on the Jags in London, which always seems to be a pretty safe play. Costi, from a sharp trading play perspective, and we know we can get all of your sharp trading plays by just texting the number below. What's the any early look on this on this line and, and how it's going to affect the betting action? Well, so early on, um, as the sharp trading play platform we actually released this game at plus six Monday morning. So we're doing a lot of the work early in the week. The advantage of what we do is we're looking for those sharp lines that we believe are going to move the other way at game time. Look, getting six, basically a home game for Jacksonville at home is going to be a difference maker. They play well in that stadium. It's They didn't even travel. So you have to factor that in. Factor that in. Um you're coming off a team that, yes, they only beat the Falcons, but they beat them handedly. And it's a typical letdown spot for the Bills that are not playing at home. They beat up on a division rival, which really was a Miami letdown spot after that 70-point performance. So coming in, I love the six. I love that fact that the Jaguars are comfortable and there's not going to be any, you know, you know, delays of getting there or travel times, any of that stuff really plays a big role. So if you can get six now, great. If you think it's going to move plus seven, definitely grab more. That's what we do at Sharp Trading Plays is we not only bet the game, but then if the line keeps improving, then we bet it more. So we constantly have improved lines throughout the week. So love the six, just like you. All right, so there's the early look. I like, from a handicapping perspective, just lean to the Jags early. Sharp trading plays also going that way. Of course, you can get my picks at the website and sharp trading plays. Call or text the number. No obligation, but you'll hear all about the program in detail. I got to tell you, you guys are going to love it.